Welcome back. If they tell you to go fly a kite this weekend, the island is the place to go. Beginning Thursday, it's the annual Kite Fest at South Padre Island, and except for one event, everything else is free. Here's Rick Diaz with today's Call Mi Gente. They are absolutely fun to marvel at and watch. This is the part that's free. Bring your lawn chair and enjoy. How are you doing today? I'm doing fine, thank you. This is Bill Doan, the man responsible for putting on the Kite Fest every year. This is Rick Diaz with Channel 5 ah, News. Hi. Bill and his wife Susie and their son John own BNS Kites. At one time, there were three kite shops on the island, but the other two are gone. He opened his store 21 years ago. Kites are my hobby, and uh, it is fun. And so I decided to quit truck driving and to become a, a fun guy and sell kites. I've been flying kites since I've been four years old. My grandfather and I used to make them out of paper, flour, glue. Kites have certainly changed from those days. Now you can make them do tricks, and you don't even have to wait for a strong wind to help you. This is an indoor kite. It, as you can see, it's a very small kite that looks like paper or plastic. And they fly indoors. And on Thursday, they will be putting on a show. There'll be people flying two-line kites, and there'll be a lot of people flying four-line kites, and this is all indoors without fans. At the convention center on January 30th at 6.30. Tickets are $10. And this year, Bill is going to do something special during the indoor flights. Got to be flown for the national anthem. And who's going to fly it? I am. I get to be a kid. But what did Susie think when Bill told her he wanted to open a kite shop? Well, I thought he was crazy. But I will say South Padre Island has been a great place to raise our son. And we uh, got people coming from Canada, British Columbia, Victoria, and we're going to have a gentleman from the United Kingdom coming. It all starts with the indoor flights on Thursday evening. The outdoor flights, Friday and Saturday, are free. Yeah, we just yes. learned about the kite fest, so we're going to bought some kites, and we're going to be there. For Channel 5 News, I'm Rick Diaz. Oh, they all have that.